Hello, 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 and welcome back to the stream. We're playing more Tales of Berzia, of course, of course, of course. Check out our expedition. Windvern Attendant and Socket. Windvern Attendant Stew, a quintessential stew. Carefully simmered until even the toughest meat melts in your mouth. Scout sh Fair enough. Okay, V. I need you to find us our next Earth Pulse point. I found one, but it's really, really far. Way up in the northeast. Hmm. If it's that far out, it has to be an Engand. Endgand is a collection of small islands. There's a comparatively bigger one called Lionel Island, but that's the exception. Yeah, I think the Earth Pulse Point's probably out there. Endgand, huh? Those waters are haunted by ghost ships, you know. Ghost ships? Yep. Legend has it they snatch up wrongdoers who bear lingering regrets and whisk them away to that eternal voyage. That doesn't sound promising. Currents from all over the world converge in Engen's waters, so a lot of shipwrecks from distant seas end up there as their final resting place. Uh-huh. Ah. So that's where the stories of ghost ships come from. Boo. You guys have no imagination. I'd rather they stay imaginary myself. We should still be careful. We'll be fine. Ghost ship, exorcist, whatever comes along. We'll be the ones to administer their last rites. Uh -huh. Just one Therian to go. When I escaped, Ceres told me that Artorius could still be killed. That means she must have known everything. That Enominat is incomplete. How Therians work. But why did she betray Artorius? Why did she give me her strength? I know that try as you might, some fires can never fully be extinguished. But what made you go so far as to feed yourself to me? Tell me. Why did you do it, sis? Oh, what am I saying? Ceres was a Moloch. Just a Moloch. Just focus on what has to be done. Once the Therians are all together, I can end this. That's all that matters. That's all I need to think about. The time to depart already. Don't you think you should rest a little longer? The Phantom Fleet carries guilty souls away. Cross its path, I'll be lonely when you're all taken. Looking pale, Velvet. Take care of yourself, alright? Aid enough. I see. That's alright then. Well, my belly is full. I'm ready to go anytime. Currents around Engan are naughty, all right. It's a dreadful place to sail. Not that the Van Eltia can, can't handle it. That prince you brought back is one interesting guy. He's happy playing with the dogs, right? And that's perfectly normal. But I swear, he even naps with them. And that hawk, with a big smile on his face? And when Dial or Kamawana ask him to put in some work, he doesn't make a face or nothing. He just gets right to it. Wait, they're asking the prince to do chores for them? Isn't that a little much? Yeah. Honestly, I was worried about it, too. But when I asked him about it, he said not to worry. And get this! The guy says when he lived in the palace, he couldn't even yawn without getting permission. He couldn't even play with his dogs, let alone help other people with their tasks. Everything was the job of his servants. So anything we tell him to do, no matter how trivial, the guy happily does it. Says he really feels like he's alive. Wow! Feels like he's too good a guy to be a prince. You got it backwards. 
I'd love to see what a nice guy who gets the common folk does once he starts calling the shots. But if he were to rejoin the royal family, he'd be our enemy, wouldn't he? At the very least, he wouldn't try to control how we think, like the Abbey's doing now. Either way, you're pirates. You plunder other people's ships. I think you'd be the enemy of any state. True. Princess Zone problems with Sangu pirate. Life's actually pretty fair when you look at it that way. Unrelated note, what sort of ransom do you think you could demand for a prince? And great timing. I've got a question. What would you say the four great wonders of the ocean are? Far as I know, it's the Phantom Fleet, Dragon Island, the Big Hedian Tribe, and the Kraken Queen. Ha <laughs> ha! See? I'm right. But this scoundrel insists he knows better than me. What else could the fourth be but the Kraken Queen? The colossal upright eel. Besides, the Kraken Queen is just a fantasy cooked up by girl starved sailors. What's the Kraken Queen? What do you mean, fantasy? It's not just a fantasy, boy. The Kraken Queen is a slippery black squid, the size and shape of a lusciously proportioned woman. When it encounters a human, it goes into a frenzy, attacking with its long whip-like arms. That sounds painful. Real painful. Mind-numbingly painful, even. But here's the thing. At some point, the pain turns into pleasure. You mean it feels good to get whipped? You see, boy, that's why we call her the mystery. Hey! Bad pirate! Stop corrupting our youth! Corrupting? Boy, there's no need to contain your curiosity. When pain turns to pleasure, you've truly become a man. Lappy set? Don't listen to them. This is something you should hear. Aren't you curious why the Kraken Queen is a wonder of the sea? Want to find out? Yes, tell me. Why? Normally, it hurts to be whipped. Nothing pleasurable about that. You don't like getting hurt, right? No. It hurt when Teresa hit me. I didn't like it at all. And yet the Kraken Queen grants pleasure through pain. The Kraken Queen's tentacles secrete some sort of unknown, pleasure-inducing substance. When they touch you, the pleasure is beyond. All right, we're done here. The Kraken Queen is no longer allowed to be the fourth wonder. It's now the Colossal Upright Eel. Argument over. Tell Luffy said about this eel, and keep it wholesome. Um, sure. The Colossal Upright Eel is as big as a whale, and long and straight like a marlin's bill. Cut it open, steam it, then baste it with a special sweet and sour sauce, and grill it twice over charcoal, and it's heavenly. Or so I hear. Mmm, that does sound really good. I know, right? The problem is, its name is an apt one. Colossal. It's too big to catch? No, the upright part. When people try to catch it, it stands up on its two legs and zoom! Off it goes, running on top of the water. It's a fish? With legs? Now that's a wonder, right, kid? Well, at least it's a wholesome one. 
Through this, I became a pirate because I want to be spanked by a cracking queen one day. Alright, I'd like to have a nice bowl of colossal upright eel one day and soup made from its liver on the side. That was a very interesting conversation. Kyle, what are you doing out here, bro? Huh? Kamoana's not here, is she? No, she's not. Are you looking for her? No, the opposite, actually. I'm hiding from her. Kamoana saw my tail fall off, and now she's absolutely obsessed about it. I'm worried that if I'm not careful, she'll try to sneak up on me and give me a big scare, and I'll drop this new tail after it's just regrown. Is dropping your tail such a big deal? Well, if I need to make a quick escape, I can't exactly drop my tail without having one to drop. Oh, I see. That's fair. Okay, well, that's very interesting. There's other people hiding around this camber of the station. Where's the others are from War. I already saw a Kuro guy. Tamawana and uh Adissa. He found in a ball seems to be a complete volume and anointed as well with his fortunate for us. Be able to decipher it on my own, but it'll take a bit more time. I see. Oh, wait. See, done. Phew, I've been bent over this book so long I've gotten a cramp. Be a deer, rub my shoulders, fell, but I don't mind helping you out, but where are your shoulders again? That's fair. Where the doggies are. I like them. They're good, stout, manly dogs you can rely on. Oh, not dogs. Therians, right? Boss. Nah, they're just puppies. Don't worry about it. They just got a little bit of the demon eye. Don't worry about it. No problem. message from the skipper. The back chamber of the basement will now be Kamoana and Medissa's quarter. Anyone who enters without permission will be executed. I'll remember that. Skipper draws a line you never ever cross.
nobody there. Wait, no, the first one. It's our good natured bunch. If a cr bit little crude, come on, come on, dial myself, share their spirit. I think that I knew nothing of the world. I was destined to rule over. That about the way it goes, though. Not the other people's beliefs, rather than actually. Even. You have to do it right. You're so mean, Medissa. If you keep telling me what to do, I'll hate you. Fine. Hate me then. So long as you do what I say. Fine. Uh, I love you, Medissa, and you don't even care. Uh, what's going on here? Eleanor, Medissa's being mean. She keeps telling me to dry my hair after my bath, but I don't wanna. What? Is that all you're arguing about? This is important. Just because she's a Therian doesn't mean she can't catch a cold. But I won't! I won't catch a cold! I swear! I don't want to take Mom's yucky, awful medicine, so I'm not gonna get sick. If you insist on being so stubborn, we can do this the hard way. There's no need for everyone to get so worked up. Her hair's pretty much dry already, right? Yeah, what she said! I'm spoiling her, aren't I? Seriously. 
Look, we don't even know what would happen if Etherian catches a cold, let alone how to treat it. That's true. But look, I get it. I know you feel responsible for her. You mean, what happened to her mother? Yeah. Luffy said told me about it. My my, look who's a little tattletale. I'm sorry. But I thought Medissa should know, just in case. It's fine, I suppose. I should have told her myself. Well, at least I understand everything now. It's all too tragic for words. Yes. And the knowledge would not be something that a young child could possibly bear. I'm not planning on telling her. That's probably your only option. But do you really think you can keep lying to her forever? I have to. For her own sake. For her, huh? All right. I'll go with you on this. You two are going through an awful lot of trouble for a selfish kid. All kids are selfish. They're selfish. But that's what their families and their mothers should be there for. Don't you have any memories like that yourself? Sorry, but I'd rather just keep them to myself. Pish and Piffle. Everybody in their issues, am I right? Just one Therian left. Stay on your toes. The Abbey will be desperate. No, I've started to get used to this island. It's a regular den of hyenas. Check to see if the side quest. I still gotta go find Victory 
is ours. Need to go run that. That's where this thing first started. I do have some. Crazy guys, thought I did. No, 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 no. Sure where it is. Just got more bait while we're like right around the corner from. Ah, it's all the way over there. Crash. Ah, that was the special one. Okay. Nice. Oh, at least I didn't have to waste much uh, bait. That works. Alright. 
really thought that thing was gonna catch me if I'm being honest. It looks like Portagurn might actually be back open. These ones. I'll finish this quickly. Yeah, there they are. Wall man. Its guardian was was angry at it. Worse. Move on to the Anamala ring. Where'd the other one go? Ah, there. I'll finish this. One, two, three. It's over, right? I see. Happy I'm alive back in here. I'll finish this quickly. I won't improve, but was that the item? It all the others. Oh no, that guy looks a little weird. Finish this. This is I can't even call that a fight. Did I? Yeah, I did. Ooh, this is one of the plants that regrow. Nice. First, I'm pretty sure that leads yeah, to around. So I want to explore the other room first. Oh, this leads around. Remember that's when they gave me the kicking boulder to do. Pretty early in the game. Okay. Master. Keep root. Yeah, they do. Also, one of the plants here is 
down there. Not working. Well, that leads out here. I don't know where the tunnel went. When the game originally had me come through here, there was like an actual tunnel. Something. Like we came from up, not up there where it's climbing. Like right to this wall. Okay, we'll go check out the other two rooms we left by. Seems like everything loot wise reset. At least I would know I was good for the chest. Thank you. 
That was a nice little line of soul. Another one. Twice. Fate has said that he is to live. <laughs> Actually, I should just be the potion, right? Um, run, enter. Yeah, this is what it could be. Nice. They decided to drop in it. And we're already up to seven. It was good. It'll be gone in like two cat chests, but. Nice to have.
Or where we first met Aizen. Right, if this is where this is. Gun okay, I guess this counts as part of the dungeon. Five hundred enter. Doesn't have one. Back over here. 
Like, ah, it is regrown. And I complained about it, but I just wasn't looking in the right areas, man. I found like a good six or seven plants that have regrown. The arm. Grab the souls while we're there. Guess that means a pot. Really put this new one out of work. Feels so weird not having my. There it is. Wait, if that's where that. Oops. There we go. Was the Kuragane's fair enough? This is a lot faster with this ideal board. Can't wait to see what other skin have for it though. This one's a pretty cool 
flying car for that. What's up? That's the that is my expedition is ready. There was an island here, I didn't mean. Why, dude? Also, checking. There should only be one drop missing. Or. I think. And Shenlong, of course. But that's because we didn't actually do that yet. <laughs> uh, that is definitely closer. But over there. Oh. Near the western area. There we go. There, that's the air. The other side. Because yeah, I remember this being. Oh, I don't have a new board. I have a, a skin for it. Yeah. I got one uh, from one of the little mini games. Pretty cool. Ooh, a new fishing spot. Try and fish up the big one. You a gee? Now I know when I got it though. One, one um, bite means a regular. Two bites I think means a medium, but three bites so far. Yeah, there we go. We got it. Pearl colored arowana. All we needed from that area. Oh, well, spin. Might as well throw one cockroach in there. Just to get that extra point so I can buy one of the things. Man, they keep adding stuff. They added the broke and the sideburns and the pirates broke. Rockers, I'm trying to buy everything. I'm adding. It's already bad than anyone. Two, four, six, eight, fourteen. I need like 15,000 to have them all. Yikes.
I can jump across that? Heck. That plant has not regrown. Sure. <laughs> coin collector? Get coins as possible. <sighs> Trying to mess truly really fantastic. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck. Watch me earn a new one. That's right. Oh. Yeah. I am. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. I ride the face. that I get that. Let's start. I'm gonna pick up this to you. Okay. This has got a cool little magic effect under it. Oh. 
There's no flame stone. Why not burn charcoal like old did? I don't know if the folk, town folk know how to make charcoal. Fires and hell were visible even. Nah, they all exploded. Tragedy. Hello, travelers. Have you heard of a demon called Dial? No, never mind. Forget I said anything. Knowing wouldn't help me. Maybe he's fighting a hard battle against the Lord of Calamity. Heh, preaching alone won't slay a single demon in high time the Abbey tasted. I thought I was getting another board skin for that. I love these, the short end supplies since the was destroyed. That way can be slow to respond. Can you do anything to help? I understand they're in trouble. Well, let's not kid ourselves. They ignored us. Treat us like vagrants for you. Now they come begging for help? But what of the Abbey's rule? <laughs> Damage in Hell of Bees was real bad. The Abbey even moved its people from there to the fall these Pride comes before a fall, they say. Float at the the Abbey fails at World of Men is doomed.
Call it for just about. Hear what's happened this time, team. Back to faulties for her. Left none alive. That lady Medissa, I think her name. One of whose daughter came out. What wicked brutes. Even if they were rule breakers, they're still a loving family. Let's play for them at least. That the Imperian Nominat will care for them. Not cares not for your trifling. We'll be right back though, guys. I gotta eat the bathroom.
Ugh, all right, guys, I am back. Let's go. Oh, my expedition. Cover, but we still need right here. Scout ship setting sail. Oh, wait. Go farm that item. Item I'm missing. But I'm this close. I won't miss. Form zero. 
was a close one, but I am the victor. Close one, but I am the victor. That's it. That's bad. So there we go. You can start using the SP. 
I don't think we got it, but... I will be right back, though, guys. One second. Alrighty guys, sorry but I had to help her get the stuff ready for bed. Alright, I can do it again. Four, four, 
Close one, but I am the victor. Did you get the item? We did. about this stuff. So much for the ghost ships. Should we expect another welcome party waiting for us again? No. I had the Blood Wings spread a rumor that we were raiding an Abbey compound far, far from here. As far as plans go, that's better than nothing. Hm. All this cloak and dagger. Give me a good old frontal assault any day. First mate, sir. There's a ship drifting ahead of us. A ghost ship? It's an Abbey ship. Their flag. It's a distress signal. Understood. Commence approach. Are you actually going to help an enemy ship? A ship signaling distress has neither allies nor enemies. That's a code all seafarers abide by. It's an obvious trap. Not even pirates would use a distress signal for a surprise attack. Of course, after we rescue a ship, we still strip them of everything they've got. Anyway, if it's a trap, we'll kill everyone on board. Simple. <sighs> a waste of time if you ask me. <laughs> Just kill everybody on board. Benwick, do we still have any Salatoma left? Yes, sir. If this is their full crew, we should have enough on board to treat them. Now that you mention it, don't Abbey ships usually have a bigger crew? These were all who were aboard when I hijacked the ship and made them set sail. Teresa! I knew I was being reckless. But I never expected we'd run afoul of the Corsair Scourge. Ah, so that's what happened but you know, to her. I'm glad we did. Since it brought me to you. You seriously plan to fight in that condition? No, no. I know you've won this one. Use me as you will. Use you? Don't bother asking. It's a trap. Lionel Island is where you'll find Dees. Hatharian. My brother Oscar is guarding over it. We can handle him just fine. You should know that Oscar's acquired a powerful new art. Its formula developed by Lord Melchior. 
The art heightens a Moloch's power far beyond its normal limits. The effect is incredible. Normal arts don't even compare. Even were you to win, you wouldn't come away unscathed. Why are you telling us this? The art is still untested and imperfect. There's no guarantee its caster will survive the effects. I don't want anything to happen to Oscar. If I'm your hostage, Oscar won't move against you. This will afford you a window to snatch the Therian and make your escape. You're willing to betray the Abbey? There's nothing in this world that could ever replace Oscar. Technically, she's not, no. uh, not betraying the Abbey. She got fired. I know you can't trust me, so don't give me your medicine. I'll place my life in your hands. Just save Oscar. Lady Teresa! If true, this information will be of use to us. For now, let's bring her aboard and give her the medicine. And we got a whole crew going now. So many people. So you're going to believe her story? An art that boosts a Moloch's power far beyond its normal limits. Sounds like we might be in for a real fight. And she said that Melchior developed it, too. Maybe this explains why he was so intent on acquiring that Siegfried relic. If this is all true, a frontal assault might not be the best idea. But why do you think Teresa is willing to go so far to protect Oscar? Oscar is the second son of the Dragonia family, aristocrats with ancestral ties to the Asgard royal lineage. From what I understand, he was sent to the Abbey in the hopes of strengthening his family's ties to the group. For the good of the bloodline. Happens all the time. Teresa followed him to the Abbey, where she's been his constant savior, even if she's kept it from him. So she's another noble too. Could have had an easy life if she'd just kept in her place. No, Teresa was conceived, uh, outside of formal matrimony. And her mother was not of what you'd call high standing. Ooh. <laughs> it happens more often than you might think. My mother died, and my father's wife never cared for me. So I merely served the Dragonia family as a maid. Those were dark, lonely times for me. But Oscar... Oscar was the only one who called me his sister, and embraced me as family. Does a sister need any other reason to want to save her brother? So you're back on your feet. My sincere thanks for the medicine. I can't use you as a hostage if you're dead. Where's the Therian? Ahead through the Baird Marsh are the ruins of an ancient kingdom. There you'll find the Earth Pulse Point, along with Oscar. Um, what happened to number one? Lord Artorius took number one away from me. As it stands, I'm without the powers of an exorcist. As such, whether I live or die is for you people to decide. Once Oscar is safe, you can do whatever you like to me. We'll do as you wish. All of it. All right. I know you know this, Fee. But don't let your guard down for one second. I won't. Two chests, we got the Geo point. Got a few combers. Any new hunts other than the one I know about? I already knew about that one.
I'll send a Sylph J if anything comes up here. Have a safe trip. Thanks. Still, why would the Abbey build anything all the way out here? Teresa, what do you know? This island may be uninhabited now, but judging from the ruins, we can tell that civilization has flourished and fallen here many times. This island lies at a focal point of air and sea currents, as well as the flow of the Earth Pulse. That means that malevolence gathers here, too. Is that why civilization has risen and fallen here before? It is. Furthermore, the malevolence of those long-dead people still lingers here, lost and unfading. Even after so long? The more they prospered, the greater the loss of life. Normally, this sort of thing could not be ignored. The malevolence here should have been dealt with in haste. But because the Abbey is scheming to resurrect Enominat, there's no way they'd want to waste such a bounty. Bursting with malevolent juiciness, and no meddlesome people around to cause trouble. There couldn't be a more perfect spot. If there's one place they'd put Etherian, it's here. Ooh. Lionel Island is pretty big. Make sure you're well supplied before heading out. Oh, so the other. Seventy five, that's not bad. Cats invitation, invitation. Cats is. I want to see me. Taliesin. Yeah, I don't think I can go back to Talia. I'll have to do that. I'll have to remember to do that. That at least become a. Alright, memory it is. Hope ADHD doesn't stop it. Kind of supplies, yeah. Paper. The extra. Accident sentiment. As That's bad. Dropping it. This is an Abbey encampment. No one's stationed here now, but it's well maintained. From what I could gather, it will be approximately ten days before the next patrol stops by. That's more than enough time to find the Therian and get it off the Earth Pulse. We can rest here, too. No need to rush things. We'll find the Therian, but let's do it right. I'm gonna say this island is slowly sinking and will vanish under the waves. And... I don't get it, though. I mean, it's hard to imagine the land moving as if we're alive, right? I knew this would be big. What a treasure! Enigmatica crystal discovered on the Centurion Isles, said to balance the energies between our dimensions. Okay. Scout oh. ship setting sail. Still need one food from it. Or one of the things. What do we get here? Demon ship learned directly from Captain Ifrit. This advanced with you dogs can hand. Batch time down me. That color reminds me of the Scarlet Knight. Wow, it's spectacular, Velvet. That deep, deep red. It's like a sunset reflected in the ocean. That's what you see, huh? Did I say something funny? No, not at all. But I hadn't noticed the same color of a sunset I once saw with Lafayette. I guess the beauty in anything comes from what you bring to it. Nice. I'm so addicted. Damn hoverboard. Man. Feels so weird. Teresa, it's been a while. We haven't seen each other since the throne. 
But that doesn't seem like so long ago to me. Not when I keep hearing so much about you. Eleanor Hume, the traitor. What of the Corsair Scourge? Nothing to worry about. I've had my dose of Salatoma. Was it as bad as you remembered it? Brings you back to when you were an initiate, doesn't it? Why did you betray us, Eleanor? When the Abbey made you a patrolling inspector, they placed great responsibility upon you. Oscar should have been the one to take on that role. He had already been selected for it. But you wanted it so very badly, and that sweet, naive man that he is, he let you take it. I had no idea. Oscar had already been chosen? Yes, and after he passed on it, he was stationed on that dangerous island where he sustained that awful wound. And now, you accompany the monster that nearly killed him. I feel I have a right to some answers. My desire to save humanity has not changed. I have simply found a path different from the Abbey's. I don't find that answer acceptable. I didn't think that you would. I know very well that you offer no compromises when it comes to Oscar. You're right. I don't. Be sure to inform your new friends of that fact. In order for me to protect Oscar, I'm going to need you all to trust me. That's all I have to say to you. I understand. Fair enough. Yeah. Hear it. I heard that they use this island to hold exiled prisoners. Just looking at this place depresses me. I hate it here. We can't go carelessly wandering about. This place is dangerous. I know, I know. Still, from the looks of those ruins, there used to be one impressive civilization here. I can practically taste the hidden treasure. The punishment for tomb raiding is quite strict, you know. Think I'd be a pirate if I was afraid of the Abbey? I won't stop you from looking for loot. But if you get into trouble, don't expect us to save you. Got it? Aye, aye, sir. Not just here. Demons are turning up in ruins, caves, anywhere there's signs of loot. Tough time to be a treasure hunter, that's for darn sure. Now, this... Doesn't seem that large at the current moment. Huh? Well, obviously, I gotta get rid of that. They really expect me to go running off without, like. That probably blocks off other ones. I can go to the optional area. Alright, let's fucking hack it up. Let's throw this in. Oh. Nothing in particular. I want. Cool. That was an interesting attack. Guess not an item in that. Right? Yes. What's enemies do now? For this, though, I want hot velvet. You know what you're getting. Yes, I know what I'm getting into. <laughs> you're strong, but I'm stronger. For three, strong, for three, for four, for six, strong. <laughs>
Well then, let's move on. Nice. Use a mythic art to finish them. Hired. Crafting. Crafting. Oh, I guess I can do that again. I don't think for the golem. but it's most likely at the top left. That would make the most sense. Well as oh no. Barrier. Was that Did supposed I? to be a joke? We haven't fought this yet. Be proud. You made me unleash my full power. Watch him. He did. <laughs> oh, he hasn't done his spell. Archive. On them. If you want to live, get out of my way. Combo. Out of no, I can't even pay it. That fight wasn't going to be extended much longer anyway. <laughs> Oh, 
Unarmed? Hardly. Unarmed? Hardly. The deadly weapon is obvious. Don't have the items rather than only one of the ones that actually have the items. <laughs> Form zero! Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try! We're going for a full combo on this. Spirit Blade! The light of virtue! The dark of light! Joining chaos! Chaos blue! Now, with a single breath, they appear! Here they come! There's no stopping them now! Good! Chris! <laughs> Why would it drop its height? Oh, hey. Go ahead, one over here. <laughs> Daggers, spirit dagger, higher ones. First. Well, that's pretty cool, though. They look sick. I like the fact that the weapons at least have like actual. <laughs> 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 Form zero! Stand up! Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try! Perfect mayhem! Perfect! Watch it! Form seven! Step! No escape! That's all, huh? Die! For three! Good! For three! For the blue! For four! Form six! See this? I unleashed all my power. Alright, well, all that first thing. 
that. Something back there. The yellow one, huh? Yeah, I see that over there. Mushroom. Alright. This section. A lot of those barrier. Always ready to fight. Hey, is everyone all right? Kind of sucks. Oh, wait, nope. Fine. I'll have to place it. Placement.
I was just getting warmed up. Scout scout yet. Back out. Okay. On to battle. But I'm this close. I won't miss. Form zero. Stand up. You ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just strong. Perfect mayhem. Here, please. The light of virtue. The dark of vice. Joining chaos. Chaos moves. Now, with a single breath, they appear. Here they come. There's no stopping them now. Good. Hey, is everyone all right? Burn roars. A power number two displayed at the throne. Hard to believe he had that hidden in him. Lord Melchior said that number one was full of untapped potential as well. If I have the talent to use it. Uh, Teresa, my lady, you seem angry. Me? At what? At me, for running away and joining Velvet. Oh, that? I was careless. An enemy stole a tool of mine. I'm merely frustrated at my own incompetence. A tool? I don't care what happens to me now. Not as long as I can save Oscar. I'm the one who hurt your precious brother. And you're asking for my help now? Yes, you hurt him. You scarred his face, and his honor, and his heart. Still holding a grudge then? Well, at least you won't be able to kill me in my sleep. With no Malachim, I'm an ordinary woman. How could I threaten the Lord of Calamity? I'm painfully aware of my own weakness. Good. Try to keep out of the way then. Lady Teresa, Velvet isn't so different from you. She had a little brother, she... I know all about the Lord of Calamity, but none of that matters to me. As powerless as I am now, this is the only path for me. It's the only way I can save Oscar. Lady Teresa. Broom. So I gotta head back and change the barrier. I had a feeling the barrier was going to be wrong. You see, there's a blue one here, but there was a yellow one here. Activated on the other side of the um, level transit. And I had a choice between the yellow and the blue one. It was the yellow one, and I probably wrong. Activate that. Then activate. Then when we go back, the blue one should be down, but we can always restore it. We can always just hit. Back. 
That way the green one on the left will be gone. Nice. Enemies have shuffled a bit. We still need this oh, one. And ah, the one that's paired with. Very nice. Oh, 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 oh. Blast, you missed my snuggles. It might be a minute. Yeah. I gotta get to a spot worthy of stopping. <laughs> Victory is ours. Okay, um. Oh, there was a yellow crystal right there, bro. Come on, attack me. Gonna attack me again. I must have timed that one, but I did not. I still got up to three. I got my ult charge from it. That wasn't worth the effort. Oh, 
Let's go deal with the equipment everybody met. Quartz daggers ready master. Nice. Go to the And he finally gets to move to the blob ring. Okay, I come across many dragons. Okay, you have what? Quartz bracelet and actually is technically a damage so we'll start with that. Mastered. Go with as all a ring. Can move on. L ring. Igor, finally. On to the. Don't have any new. Doll though. Or stall. Look at it, it's winking. That's pretty cool. Um. And, eh. We're different. Quartz one has boots is done. Or you can use the hover jet. I is done. You can move on. Other first plate. I like the way that looks. That looks sick. I'm pretty sure the hover jet poop. Still waiting for the right. Be done. So don't have any new Another quick save because I don't wanna have to do all that equipment ping stuff again. So we should only need the octopus. Which is gonna be nice. But we still gotta keep fighting everything because it can be anywhere on any of them at any time. Don't get careless! Ground him. Gonna earn that ult charge that way I don't have to farm very hard. Luckily, this isn't really farming because I'm still exploring at the same time. And the fact that I already have three out of four of the enemies for this zone. All it's burning is pretty good. Oh, look at it go. Did you see my complete and utter Okay, that's the head right there. Yeah, it's got two of the octopus. Uh, yeah. Weak enough and then kill it with this. <laughs> 
Thunder. Hey, is everyone all right? Did not. That happened. Grab this and tap them in the butt. There we go. We already have enough all charge for the next fighting of the octopus. These golems are really good for that. <laughs> Hey, is everyone all right? The runner's high is done. Be sure the only boot needs one they're currently. Yes. Wait. Wait a minute. Yeah, swap with Eleanor, because Eleanor can go work on the damn quartz boot. Apparently, gift boot. Go work on that. What are you doing? Let's hop across the rocks. Oh my, okay, um, well. Okay, well the goal is through that one. So we don't go to the top left one. That's good to know. Really good to know. Especially for all us, uh, flexionists out there. Oh, I can't come through here. <laughs> Cause the fucking wall's not broken. Yet. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> Fuck me, I guess, for coming this way. I guess I'll go around. <laughs> uh, I didn't know there was going to be a shortcut there. Fair enough, though, I guess. Ooh. Well, at least I'm rewarded with more of these. Capsule. 542 is pretty good. Might be able to afford two chests if they're, like, on the cheaper end like they have been. Ooh, hey, look at that! Hey, buddy! You'll be rushed by my blade. Oh, we're fucking, we're fucking up. Right Form zero. Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try. Perfect mayhem. Boom. You broke me. Here's your job. Boom. Now, with a single breath, they appear. No, we fucking them up. Boy. Not just one hole. That guy got a quadro hole. You really do have a peculiar. Any items? Yeah. Game, bro. My luck. Another one over here. I don't think we'll have anything to alt it with, but fuck it. You'll be rushed on my regular non boosted luck. Other than the fact that I think we do have something that boosts our buff for items we don't have. What was that on evil? That might have only been on evil difficulty. It's a difficulty I actually don't have a lot I'm on hard right now, which is uh, one difficulty from the current. Another victory. But yeah. So. Oten. Oh, that just increased. No items are received drop rates increase by two. It has to be with no item. Not as helpful as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I mean, it's still helpful, but it's not helpful. Maybe we can finish that one up. Okay, we got a blue barrier. But it doesn't seem to be blocking anything. The yellow one does. You'll be rushed on my blade. All right, all right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
time gets close. I won't miss! Form zero! Stand up! You ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try! Perfect mayhem! Smart enough to die. See this? No escape! Rhino threat! Blast! See this? Hurricane! Watch it! Form seven! Lucky cross! Drop! See this? Hurricane! Go on! That's all! See this? Get away! Watch it! No escape! <laughs> Victory is ours. Ended up the other ones. Item didn't work. Yeah, we got the cover too. But I think I have to go back once scene anyway. Yeah, I gotta go back one scene and off the yellow one. Maybe the blue one too. I'm gonna turn them both off just as a predecessor because like if that blue one's there there's probably a green barrier next that seems to be the way these barriers are I'm gonna come all the way back here to where that blue barrier is the little gem next to me. luckily I cleared all the enemies from so bad I wish I had my damn hoverboard but I haven't found the geo point They normally don't give me the geo point till near the end of the level. <sighs> I'm just so used to it because I have literally had it for like the last, like obviously not the like story ones, but for like collecting items that I've had it. I activate this, which is the barrier there. Yep. This area hopefully should be clear. I'm tired of this running back and forth. Already tired of it. <laughs> Some bull shit. Yes! Aha! I'm glad I predicted that that green. Otherwise, that would have been a hell of a walk around. Again, just a turn off. Guys, like the guy! Koreans let me encounter them a lot, but they don't seem to be as worth as much as old cars for when I do. That's all. I unleashed all my power. Maybe I overdid it. Done with the fate. Done with it. No. Oh no, we didn't get that one. Well, Eisen will. Then Eisen will swap. And then after Rotodoku's done with, I mean, not Rotodoku. After Laffy Set's done with the Rotodoku. Yes! I think we got last thing for the eyes. <laughs> Move on to Tito Island. We're doing good with luck everywhere but that damn octopus. There's the chest. And then I don't really care if I'm in it. it. It's fucking. Like, they refuse to alt kill enemies I'm actually trying to farm without Mama my orders. Just tools. What Aww, are you over? Said I know. Dead. Velvet, Eleanor, or Teresa. You're not sure whose little brother you want to be, eh? In that case, I assure you I'm the kindest of the lot. 
the cruelest, most devious. <laughs> That's not what's on my mind. There's something I need to say to Lady Teresa. Something you wish to say? Then speak, number two. That's just it. I'm not number two. I'm... I'm Lafayette. Lafayette? It's the name Velvet gave me. It's very important to me. Something can be important to you? Yes. I have feelings. You see, Malakim are not tools. Very well. I shall call you Lafayette from now on. Thank you, Lady Teresa. You're kinder than you look, my dear Teresa. Thank you, Teresa. You misunderstand. With so much at stake, I don't want to rock the boat. Velvet, tell me what you know about Teresa and Oscar. Are we at conversation I want a picture in between? Do. All right. Teresa and Oscar are. I can give you the lowdown on everything, Abby. Lady Teresa and Oscar are the best of the best, even among the Praetors. Some call them the consoles. There are only around a This one where they're gonna end up bullying Ben for so they actually give some explanation. Elite. Anyone called a console is going to be adept at both fighting and leadership. They are key figures entrusted with responsibility for major cities and institutions. The fighting part is all we have to worry about. Are they better than you, Eleanor? Yes. I was a Primus, which is a full rank below them. I could never overcome Teresa's arts or Oscar's swordsmanship in our practice battles. When they were still trainees, they worked together to wipe out dozens of demons in a single night. After that, Lord Melchior kept a close eye on them. Appreciated. I'll be on my guard. Together, they sound like a oh, real threat. They didn't actually bully Thankfully, we're only after Oscar alone. But Oscar has mastered a new art developed by Lord Melchior. You can count on it being a nasty one. You really do know a lot about this stuff. It's a little suspicious. You... you think so? Well, I was at the Abbey, so... Why don't you call him Lord Oscar? That's what's bothering you? <laughs> it's because we're both so popular with the ladies. I consider him a rival. <laughs> they tried to bully him, but he didn't take it. Alright, obviously if we're defeated, we don't want to have to be watched. Alright, drop the team item. We're gonna pull all from here. Ready to die? Think you can dodge? Just try. Yes, we got the chaos. Logically, this has everything, but we still got one of them. <laughs> Victory is ours. Ours. Whatever that item is. That's a hell of a rarity, let me tell ya. The grade bonus. <laughs> That's a nice juggle combo I had on. Was that supposed to be a joke? Okay, this gear is done. Item then. I don't have another spear, so we can Looks like Four of them. Ooh, fuck, the combo's me. Good one, too. It was like 800 of health. Wait, that point doesn't come out of nowhere. 
If you want to live, get out of my way. Fast. Oh, I... Fuck. Uh. Well, this is pretty obvious I'm gonna get my hovercraft. What? Oh. That looked like something else over there before I saw that it was the tree. Like, what the fuck's flying over? Okay. That leads to a chest. I know. I'll finish this quick. Oh, I'm off mid. Four, Four zero, zero thunder. Ready to die? Think you can die? Ah, just You broke me. Here's your justice. Ah, you're the only one without one. Oh, I don't know how to do that. It's really letting me down. Unarmed, hard. Oh my god. Not gonna cross it. <sighs> Effort. Gotta do that one. Ah, his butt's on the other side. Looks like you're on the side. Run away! Fly away, little birdie. Far away. Yeah, they just got fucking combo. This is got fucked up, my dude. Alright, how much is this one gonna cost? 300. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't worry, it's only, you know, half of the souls I had saved up. <laughs> For one chest. That. Why are you casting resurrection for a heal? 
Master protecting my uh, he's get away her eyes. Okay. That was a long fucking fight Get out of my way. Item is a looting. There's still plenty of fights to add. Your I see Tom, let's go. It's a beetle. Yeah, uh, a Lionel Giant Thunder Stag Beetle, to be exact. Why do they always have such awkward names? I, I think it's a cool name. <sighs> I've never been able to figure out why boys are so drawn to these things. Huh? 
What's the matter? Didn't you want to see it? Uh, yeah. Aww. Thanks. When he was little, Oscar was always running around the woods collecting bugs. He'd get so into it, it was never long before he'd trip and hurt himself. Did you grab bugs for him? Yes, I thought they were gross. But I was much taller than him, and I had the reach. Once, he gave me a whole pile of cicada shells as his way of thanking me. I just screamed. Did you deal with the beans? I'm sure he just wanted you to know how okay. he felt. Okay. I can relate to that. That's fine. Rather Not gonna change the way it is, right? <laughs> to contemplate such things. Well, I try to. It's just really hard sometimes. It's hard for people too. Sometimes it feels insurmountable, and yet we can't give up. Sometimes. You just have to say what you mm -hmm. believe in your heart, even if you're not good mm -hmm. at saying it. What I believe. V, hurry up already! Got a little side story. What were you two talking about? Nothing. Alright. Him. I'm back and deal. Enemy. I knew there was an enemy. Oh. Anchovy, pirate flag. A new recipe. I new gotta recipe. try it. A zonga veggie bagna caldo. Eating lots of vegetables will give you bazongas. What are bazongas? Scout ships. Wow, I didn't know that. That's really good information, you know? If I ever want bazongas, I know how to get it. Why can't I have this item? Okay. I don't think we I literally had the fucking hell hell the entire time. Literally, he was supposed to ult during any of those combos. I decided not to find it. Fine, I'll get it back. Hey, getting robbed with it. This is the same thing like when I have a fucking hell and a big kick in the game. Hurricane! Oh, 
Every single thing I right Dude. Gonna be another one. Alright, I guess we'll find out. Hey, Luffy set. Found a new stag beetle, did you? Yeah, Lady Teresa caught it for me. Ooh, those pincers are sharp. Eisen, take a look at this fine specimen of a stag. Wait, I believe that might be a two-horned rhinoceros beetle. Listen, you two. If you're gonna get in another fight over this, I'll just say it's a new type of drone beetle. You wouldn't. You've really figured us out, huh? <laughs> Eleanor. You didn't make him say that just now, did you? I did not. I've made a pact with him as a vessel, but he isn't tethered to me. The Moloch, acting so human. I used to think that way. Malachim possessing free will just like humans? It was inconceivable. But meeting Laffy said and Aizen taught me the truth. They laugh in joyful times and cry in sad times. Their stomachs even growl too. Their stomachs growl? Now I take it as a matter of course that not only Malachim, but demons and Therians, too, have their own thoughts and feelings. I thought you hated demons. I certainly still do, but now I feel something besides just hate. Malachim with free will? Demons and Therians as well? You must have sensed that in Laffy said, or you wouldn't have caught that beetle for him. When you saw his beaming face, it must have reminded you of when Oscar was a young boy. Am I correct? This conversation's over. Ooh. Just mad because she's right. Oh. Teresa, be honest. Isn't there something wrong with the Abbey using a dangerous experimental art out in the field? Oscar's the one who decided to go through with it. Don't presume to know anything about who he is. All right. It is a blue one over there. That one gone. A barrier off that. Aha, I see the secret here. Just the way out. Maybe I do need it. Using that art could be fatal. I can't allow oh, Oscar can you to stop try stop interrupting it? me with conversation. Lady Teresa, is something the matter? It's nothing. Fucking wait till I'm done but with this part. Like moving actually pain. towards the quest oh. point. I was just thinking a bit. You didn't have time to rest after recovering from the Corsair's scourge. You're awfully hard on yourself, you know. And even harder on others, am I? Th that's not what I meant! It doesn't matter. I'm well aware that I'm stone cold. But they say a Moloch never knows his vessel's heart. I said nothing all those times you snuck off to the library, did I? You knew about that? Of course I knew. 
but I was just letting you roam free like a master might let her little pup. Number one didn't wander about like you did. What makes you different? I'm sorry. Well, boys will be boys, I guess. But I was planning on punishing you if that behavior continued. Punish me how? You don't want to know. It might wreck your good cheer. Lady Teresa! <laughs> Look at how open she's being. Do you really think she'll work with us? I don't think she's lying to us. But I don't think she's being entirely truthful either. Look, I know I probably don't have to say this, but... You don't. I won't let my guard down. If I see anything funny, she's dead. And since she has no Moloch, it'll be quick. Barrier up there. Can't have that there. Ah. Trying to go get on with this big hunt. Good one. <laughs> oh, be going in. That's a forward killer. Billionaire. Oh, Flex the guard a lot. Ah. 
How you doing, uh, Uncle Irby? Armor Acerite Fix. Grants plus one maximum souls. Characters that be old. Ah, oh, he's finally done with military height. Pop boot. Done. That will do just fine, I guess I have to put that belt for now. The only one she's gotta do, so it's fine. Go collect all these fucking souls! Dancing Snowman is your favorite? Yeah, I love it, dude. Isn't it great? My wife made that for me. Scene. Made the scene for me. Pretty good taste. The Kappa Man uh, for the gingerbread man is uh, a whole different thing. I don't think it's called Kappa Man anymore. I think they moved to a new site. I forget. Yeah, I hope you're having a wonderful day. <laughs> um, going through. <laughs> Uh, no. Probably want to put the red berry back up. I imagine. Not entirely sure on this one. Ah. Here we go. Finally gonna get access to my hoverboard again. This thing over here is. There we go. Now I'll move a little faster. does not feel as long. Where does this like it? Yeah. Which is the other side. Yeah, this. Oh, I saw that herb. They tried to hide it from me, but I saw it. Permanent stat increase after all. Okay, now this should be where, yeah, this is finally where I was trying to go the first time, but got blocked because there's, by that bottom left corner, there is a shortcut that wasn't unlocked on the side I tried to come from. <laughs> okay, we got a red and a yellow. Not sure what we do yet, because I haven't seen the front. Okay, that one's red. Doesn't leave my gold. However, I do want to come over here real quick. Just in case. Teresa. Oh. Let's review our plan before we go in. <laughs> All right. We'll tell Oscar that we'll release you if he gives up his weapons and Molochine. We'll tie him up, collect the Therian, and then head for the docks. Once we're aboard our ship and ready to sail, we'll release you. You'll be free to do whatever you want. Very well. But I want you to promise me one thing. Promise me you won't hurt Oscar. That depends on him. I'll defend myself if I have to. Um, Velvet... Please, do it for me, too. If you want to save Oscar, you need to make him listen. Put your own Facts. life on the line. You're his sister. Do whatever you have to to protect him. I will. Even if it means my death. Fair enough. Yeah, this wall here prevented me from... Let's make sure to kick it down. Then if I ever come back through this area, I can go through it. Okay. 
There is a yellow barrier back there, so we want to hit both. This is what makes the hoverboard so much better, is because I can go back to this a lot faster. Oh, there was a chest back here. Okay, there's that. That up. Ooh, power fly. Oh, what? Oh, I don't know if I can make this game so sneak. Okay, fine. I'll come back and turn the green. They didn't want me to be able to do both. Moved it. Key sneaking. Whatever is back there is going to be good, though. There. Or at least I hope it's. Probably useless though. So. I'm a collector at heart, so. Alright, what's back here? Okay. Alright, looks like a regular loot room with two chests. But you never know, there could be fucking something. Aha! Uh -huh. Gotta be quicker than that! Anyway, I'll, a lot of these souls are. That's good. Ooh! Another military hike! Good. That was already worth it. Yeah. Died thing. Cause the Pinbo's boots in the top are like. Twelve thousand. Even though they only ever sold me one, which is for the first one. This is probably going to be where some side quests is going to be at some point. It looks weirdly empty. But any... Some other thing that isn't. Fuck, I forgot about that. Did buys. You? Yeah, I bought Topaz from him. He's working on the quartz one. But I didn't forget about that one, but I did forget about the other one. <laughs> See, Bursey is one of Chris, uh, he's Velvet's best ones. True. I like the voice. I imagine it would. I wouldn't know the actress very well. I'm not very good with knowing many voice actors from games, honestly. Sometimes I'll recognize it and look it up, but most of the time I don't really remember. But that's good to know. I mean, I could see it, because, like, I really like the voice. It feels a lot more dominant and, like, the way I would want the character to sound versus like um, Tales of Vespria's main character. I feel like he had a weird um, feeling to him. Right, I gotta go turn off the green one. I mean, the yellow one. I gotta turn it. I also like the music in this game a lot.
Like I really do. Before I realize that I'll be. Oh my god. <laughs> I love it too. I love the fact that they're so sneaky with these puzzles and stuff. It reminds me of the old days when people are like, yeah, figure out your damn self. at the Earth Pulse Point. You all know the plan, right? I'm using you as a hostage to keep Oscar from doing anything stupid. And don't you try anything funny either. What a time wait. Over here, kill the test. It's already working on here, right? Nothing master. That on. All right, come on, Oscar. I knew you'd come, Velvet. Sister! As plain as day. Now put down your sword and let go of my fairy. If you don't, I'll kill her. You coward! I'm sorry to do this, Oscar! I'm searching for the truth behind the Abbey's talk of so-called reason. And your idea of reason is to threaten my dear sister's life? <laughs> I'm sorry, Oscar. I've become nothing but a burden. Teresa, no. It's not like that. All right. I'll put down my arms. <clears throat> Teresa, get back! <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> Forgive me, Oscar. K this is the o. only way I can protect you. We've kept our end of the bargain. Take him and get out of here. <laughs> I can't do that. It will reflect poorly upon him. Lady Teresa? Have you forgotten? You're just a powerless human. You're right. I am a weak, worthless human. But he has shown me the light, and it shines. My body is receptive to Inominat's power. And with it, I can protect everything I care about. She turned into a Therian? No, she fused with it. I'll kill you all. Anything to protect Oscar! Merging with Therian. Do you realize what you're doing, Teresa? <laughs> A trivial sack. I'd do anything for my Oscar. 
Okay, that makes more. L 
Lady yeah, Teresa. I was just saying there's a, a boss down, with or I'll devour you piece the um, piece. screwdriver move to you. <laughs> and I was complaining about how I uh, kept swapping my character by mistake. <laughs> it's okay, sister. I was trying to swap You've their characters, enough. not mine. <laughs> no, don't look at me. I'm so hideous. When I was growing up, the only one my mother and father ever paid any attention to was my older brother, the heir. But you. Yeah, but Teresa, that's fair that the bo battle volume does overpower didn't. my voice you because I don't normally talk me. as much during the Smiled for fight me. anyway. So that works. When I get focused, you I know, I have ADHD, so I gotta focus on one task. <laughs> But I do appreciate the Oscar. heads up, though. Now, keep watching over me, Teresa. As long as you're looking after me, I can vanquish even the Lord of Demons. Take a good look. This is armatization. Failed Oscar. Kind of rude to call him. Effective versus level 20. That's you. What's happened to him? That's one hell of an arc. Here, Grace! You broke me! Here's your justice! Find your order! Okay, 
Oscar, stop! This has gone far enough! No, it hasn't. You people hurt my sister. He's losing control of the Moloch! Damn it! It's turning into a dragon! Velvet, quick! Devour that thing! Stop! He's still... for my birthday. They're family heirlooms that were supposed to go to his fiance, but he didn't know that at the time. I told him he should give them to the woman he cares most about in the world. And you know what he did? He smiled at me and said I was that woman. So sweet, so innocent. And you took him away! You killed my Oscar! How could you? How could you? How could you? No! Don't do it! Teresa, Oscar. <sighs> and we didn't even get the Therian we came for. He... Oscar came at him first. I had to. It was for Luffy. For my little... They enhanced it. I. Right. Nice. That'll help for late game. Done mastering everything. <laughs> They're dead. No, not just dead. I killed them. I'm the same as Artorias. I killed her brother before her very eyes. It's not the same. It is the same! But I didn't have any choice! It was the only way to avenge you! It was all for you! I did it for you!
There's nowhere left to run. Nowhere for you or for me. Nowhere left. You all right? I ate too much. That's all. They... They were close. They supported each other ever since they were children. I just did to them what they were going to do to us. And who will killing them save? The soul of my murdered brother. <gasps> oh. Whatever the case, we messed up the Therian part of the plan. They're probably making a new one as we speak. There's no time to waste. Let's go back to the port and start our search. Yeah. Show him how I so fast. Luckily, from all the fighting, we got quite a few copies of other. I. had to do it. All of it. Velvet! Put me way close to where we were. What the? About to say, wait, this is not where I fought them. I never expected that Velvet would actually eat Teresa. What else could she do? We never expected that Teresa would be a Therian either. Velvet and Lady Teresa weren't so different. They both loved their brothers. Not everyone loves their brothers. Some just want them dead. <sighs> so where does this leave us? It seems we must search for the new Therian that will fill the void left by Teresa. It won't be easy to find another who could become a Therian. Hmm. Then it won't be easy for the Abbey either. And they still may not be able to awaken in Nominat. We still can't assume that we're in the clear, though. No, we can't. If it takes time for the Therian to be reborn, this could be our chance to strike. Whatever happened, the seven Therian's ties have been severed from Inominat. But we won't know if the Empyrean has been weakened until we find out for ourselves. I can try and see if I can sense the new Therian. So let's go back to the prison island first. But I think... Velvet needs time to rest. Right. If we're gonna take down Artorius, she has to be there with us. Yeah. First mate, there's trouble. We got an emergency message from Port Zexen. A ship carrying dozens of exorcists just set sail for Titania. They have orders to eliminate the Lord of Calamity. Yeesh, looks like the hideout's not so hidden after all. It wasn't me. I didn't tell them anything. Then you won't have any problem helping us. We're rescuing the Therians. Of course not. I won't let them take Kamoana again. Wait. That information came from the Bloodwings? No, from a peddler I often do business with. Exorcist operations like this are usually kept a closely guarded secret. And you're telling me a regular civilian knew about it? You think it's a trap? 
Trap or not, we don't have a choice. Our enemies know the odds. If they've set a trap for us, that means they think they can win. The Armatus! Yes. They're likely to throw armatized exorcists at us. Even your demon arm can't eat Armati. You might just have a real problem on your hands. If I can't devour them, then we kill them. Yeah, if we overcome the Armati, we can win. Like with Oscar. But his Armatus was still incomplete. From what I could gather, if the Exorcist remains armatized for too long, their Moloch will turn into a dragon. But to prevent these dragons from running wild, Melchior embedded a self-destruction art in both Exorcist and Moloch. To think they would go that far. Oh. This is all just conjecture, of course, but we should prepare ourselves as best we can. Just make sure not to leave any regrets behind. <laughs> <laughs> I really can't fathom what the Abbey is doing. Even if they did let us know on purpose, why would they leave us be? I would have expected them to press the attack against us. Even if their aim is to capture our allies as some kind of leverage against us, their plan is too many holes. What if we decided to abandon Kamuana and the others? They'd be no closer to capturing Velvet. Do they actually want the Therians back? What are you saying? Why did Melchior place that illusion on a ball to lure Velvet in? That was so he could capture her, right? And in case he couldn't capture her, he could kill her and create another Therian. Okay, so if securing the Therians is so important to them, why would they throw Orthrus to the winds? That's a puzzler. Melchior was right there, and he didn't try to protect Orthrus at all. I don't understand it. It's like they're toying with us. I don't see any point in that either. They must know we won't give up. Actually, that could be close to the mark. What if they're just trying to rattle us? Everything would fit, including the assault on Titania. Whatever's going on, I don't think we're going to like it. So, Eleanor, about that Armatus Oscar used, was that something the Abbey has been working on for a while? I was never involved in weapons development or anything like that. But I did hear of a secret research division. Word was that they were deciphering ancient scrolls and books coming from every corner of the Empire. Apparently, Teresa knew something of the ancient tongue, and they called her in to help from time to time. Did she work on Enominat's book? I was never privy to any of the details, but I think the books were mostly about controlling Malachim. Well, that Siegfried thing of Zavid's is some kind of power control device, right? The Abbey probably learned about Siegfried in one of those books, and realized they could use it to armatize. So Melchior tracked Zavid down and stole the formula. Makes sense. It was all so they could create the Armatus. Will Eifried be alright? Complete or not, they've seen that they can use the Armatus in battle. They have no use for him anymore. Let's get back to Titania, Aizen. I'll help out with the ship. Right. Let's set sail. Alrighty, guys. That will do it for this episode.
thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed or are curious about anything else I've done, make sure to check out uh, the YouTube under the name. Because I'm not affiliate, um, the Twitch deletes my videos at week, but I take the VODs from there and I it's got most of what I've done before, so if you're interested in that, feel free to follow, feel free to subscribe to the YouTube. I hope you guys have a blessed day as you bless my stream. I'll be sure to catch you guys next time, alright? Peace.